Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to change the order of integration. The given question is integral 0 to 1, integral 0 to 2 root x, f of x comma y, dy into dx. So here, the order is, first we have to do integration with respect to y. Then the result, we have to integrate with respect to x. Now we are going to change the order of the integration. Now, the limit given here is with respect to y. So let's rewrite this. The given question is integral from 0 to 1, then integral from 0 to 2 root x, f of x comma y into dy dx. Since this is with respect to y, the limit is y. So this is y equal to 0 and y equal to 2 root x. And this is the limit with respect to x. So x is equal to 0, x is equal to 1. Now let's draw the graph y equal to 0. So we have to take x axis and y axis. This is x, horizontal axis and this is y. Now y equal to 0 is nothing but our x axis itself. This line represents y equal to 0 and y equal to 2 root x. When I square this, we get y square equal to 4x. It is a parabola. Since y is given as 2 root x, it is going to be positive. So we have only positive values for the y. It's a right side open parabola, but we have the curve only on the positive side of the y and we don't have the negative side. This we don't have because the given curve is not y square equal to 4x but it is y is equal to 2 root x. So negative value cannot come for y. So we have only the upper portion of the curve and this is y equal to 2 root x and the limit of x is 0 to 1. So 0 is nothing but this line is x equal to 0 and 1 is nothing but we have a line here. You can also extend this and this is x equal to 1. So the region which we consider is this. Now we are going to change the order of integration. So when we change the order of integration, first we want to put dx then dy. So integral, double integral, the function f of x comma y. First I want to put dx, then I want to write dy. Now since we need the limit for x first, let's take a horizontal strip like this. So extreme left side we have the curve and extreme right side we have this line. So it ranges from x value of this to x value of this. Here it is anyway x is equal to 1. But here I have to take from this curve. This curve after squaring we get y square equal to 4x. From this the value of x is y square by 4. So our limit of x is y square by 4 to 1. So here it is y square by 4 to 1. Then we have to consider a vertical strip here. So vertical strip starting from the base here on the x-axis. So here the value of y is 0 and here the maximum value. So when x is 1, if I substitute x is 1 here, then I get 2 root 1 which is 2. So this value is y is equal to 2. So the limit ranges from 0 to 2. So initially we had dy dx that we changed into dx dy and these value represents the limit of x and another one represents the limit of y, y equal to 0, y equal to 2. So clearly writing it again, integral, double integral, one is 0 to 2, other is y square by 4 till 1, f of x comma y into dx dy.